back to my channel. My name is Allison, and for today's workout, we're doing a 20-minute TerraCore cardio legs and core workout. If you haven't done it yet, make sure to tap the subscribe button and the bell to stay notified with the latest fitness videos released every Mondays and Thursdays. For this workout, all you need is your TerraCore. If you don't have a TerraCore, I'll put a link in the captions with a discount code. Follow along with my cues. I'll be showing you high and low impact versions for most of the moves, so definitely do the version that's best for you. So grab your TerraCore and some water, and let's get started. My goal for this workout is to keep it about 20 minutes, so the warm-up is gonna be really short, and you will need to cool down on your own. Starting off, you'll notice I went ahead and flipped the TerraCore over, dome side down. We're gonna warm up the core and get the heart rate up just a little bit. So hands on the handles, assume a high plank position. Now, if you're not ready for that high plank, feel free to take the knees down, still engage in the core, stacking the shoulders. And when you're ready, I'm gonna start slow. One knee in, then the other. Keeping the shoulders steady, keeping the hips steady as well. I'll start to gradually pick up the pace. Whew. Good, 10 seconds here. All right, and then coming up, just 10 quick seconds, we're gonna go double time. In three, two, double time, hit it. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, back to your hold. From here, rock forward. Rock back. If you're on your knees, you're doing the same thing. Good. Last five, four, three, and then we finish in the center. This is your warm up. <laughs> three, two, and stop. Good. Flip it over, dome side up. All right, still in extension. Last quick warm up, and then it's gonna transition right to your higher cardio. I'm gonna take it up and over. So for your up and overs, I do like to stagger the stance a little bit so that your feet don't feel crowded on top. Take that inside foot towards the top of the uh, dome and bring it back. Go ahead and join me. We're going to start with maybe 20 seconds. No hop. And remember, this is your low impact version. Good. Soft knees, entire foot on that dome. Now you keep doing what you're doing. I'm transitioning this move to a helicopter. Leg swings behind, squeezing the glutes. We're gonna go for 30 seconds. Three, two, here we go. Uplift, uplift. If you're not ready for this, you stay with what we just finished with, stepping up and over. Push off, starting to feel those legs. Good. Whew. Stay there, 15 seconds. You're doing great. Heart rate definitely coming up now. Press, beautiful. Four, three, two, and walk it out. Feel free to grab a drink anytime, even if I don't cue a break. Keeping the dome where it's at. Inside foot on, squats up and overs. Starting slow, we'll do four single squats. We'll go up and over, inside foot on, four single squats, up and over. Eventually, those will be pulses. All right, whew, heart rate's up already. Inside foot on, toe forward, join me, four singles. Deep breaths in and out. Two, up and over or step over. Set your form and then hit your four. We need to do this one more time. Let's do it one more time, slow, up and over. Four singles, four. Squeeze the glutes on top. Sink those hips back like you're in a chair. Over the top. Here we go. Four. Three. Let's go up and over. Now pulse it, double time, four, eight. Every set, we'll uh, break it down, kind of in a ladder formation. Three, two, over. Eight, seven, six. Now next round is four. In four, three, up and over, pulse for four. Then with soft feet, three, two, over. Four, three, up and over, pulse two. Two, over, we get a couple rounds like this. Two, and then when we do singles, it's at your own speed. Try it here, singles. So I'd rather form over speed. Make sure your heel touches down. Entire inside foot is on that dome. Hips and shoulders forward. Whew. Four, three, two, pulse for four. Ah, three, two, over. I will kill water break after this one. Two, over. Eight, seven, you got it. Six, here's four, one more side. Woo, up and over, pulse eight. Eight, seven, six, 
four, three, over the top, walk it out. Whew. Grab a drink and I'll meet you back here. For the next exercise, I went ahead and turned my Terra core so you can see my form. This is gonna be a full body cardio and core. We're doing a roll back and then come up, stand and jump. Okay, so first off, kind of sit down, kind of feel out your terra core, see where it, um, where you land, where you feel like you're steady on the terra core, and that you can lean back where you're not gonna, for me, hit my head on the wall or have it hang back too far. Rolling up, and then we hop up or you can stand up. So take a moment, do a couple of test ones, and then come up, and if you're not hopping, you're standing. We're doing just one set of this for 45 seconds. So I want you to take this at your own pace. If you're feeling good, you can definitely pick it up, but keep the good form. All right, start in a standing position right in front. We're gonna go in five seconds. Deep breath, ready? Three, two, here we go. Down, back, up, pop. So I do want you to go slow when you come back. Keep the core tight, and then just really explode when you stand. To modify this move, I'm gonna take it back, maybe just part way, come up, stand, squeeze the glutes. You got it. You're about halfway through time. Keep it going. Line with soft feet, soft knees. If you're doing your hop, hopefully the, um, your back feels good on the terra core. This is where that nice, softer dome-shaped surface kicks in. 10 seconds. And we'll have you finish in that standing position. Five, four, finish the one you're on and hold it up standing. Good job. All right, so I'm gonna take that terra core, turn it around so you can see my toes are gonna be on top. My hands are down on the floor for that plank position. So back to some core, look underneath you. All right, so this is a different plank than we did earlier. Shoulders back, calves tight, squeeze the glutes. If you need to, drop those knees. And then, just like we did with the warm up, except now we're kind of in a little decline position. The only difference here is I'm not gonna have you speed this up, but we're gonna change the angle a little bit. Diagonal, diagonal, yes. Whew, 15 more seconds. If you're not feeling this, you hold a stationary plank. Breathe, up, good. Five, four, three, two, and stop, good. Bring it down, come up to stand. Staggered squats with an outer thigh. All right, back to legs. I'm keeping you in a vertical position. Hands wherever you like for stability. If you need them onto the side, fine. Hips, that's fine. Or if you wanna raise them up, you can. All right, staying here. Squat, outer thigh lift. And when you bring that foot down, plant it entirely on the ground, shoulders and hips square to the front. Since we're doing one side at a time, let's do this for reps, 15. All right, ready? Deep breath. Here we go, down. Press up for one, Whew, two, squeeze, three, entirely land that on the floor, five, good, six, keep it up, keep it up, eight, nine, ten, five more, and then hang out, three to transition, we're doing those up and overs again, one more, take a moment, stay here, keep the inside foot on, all right, this time, Staggered up and overs. Up, up. All right, join me when you're ready. Light on the feet. If you're not feeling that, you can stagger it. You can take it, those up and overs like we did earlier. You can take it quicker if you want to uh, pick it up a bit. Woo! 10 seconds, and then I want you to end on the other side. Five, four, three, two, other side. Take a moment, get that inside foot on, other foot on the floor, squats outer thighs. Whew, heart rate's up. Deep breath, inhale, exhale out. Three, two, let's go. Squat abductors. Again, I'll cue a water break after the series is done. Three, four, count your own if you're not on mine. Six, seven, nice. Halfway point, you're doing awesome. 11, base knee soft. Now that you know it's coming, go right to those staggered up and overs. This is my last one. All right. Take a 
a moment. You can be here or you can be here. A little pump lift. All right, 20 seconds starting now. Gonna walk it out. Woo! Come on, come on. You've got this, 10 seconds. Don't stop. Five, four, three, two, exit on one side. Walk it out, grab a drink. For this next section, I'm gonna be really nice and keep us on the floor for our legs and our core. All right, I'm keeping the, uh, the terror core where it's at and going into a side plank position. And so for this one, I place a towel down because I feel like I'm getting sweaty. You don't wanna slip. Go ahead and put a towel down. All right, so you can either have it where your knees are down, hands down, we're going to rotate and center, or you're gonna stack the feet, lift up here, hands behind, rotate elbow towards the terra core, and then lift. Again, we're sticking with the one side at a time. We're actually gonna do all the exercises on this side, and then we hit the other side, so it is for reps. Okay, so pick your position. We're just doing 10 of these. If you're with me on your feet, have it here, engage the core, hands behind. Let's go, exhale, rotate, lift up for 10. Nine, good, drop that knee if you need to. Eight, feeling those obliques. Seven, Woo. six, five, good, four, three, two more. And then you can drop the hip, take a breather, drop it down. While you're finishing up your set and recovering, watch me. I'm gonna lift my hip, inside knee down, take this leg out. All we're gonna do is lift up, crunch center. Lift up, crunch center. And this one is going to be for outer thighs, glutes, and core. Again, we're gonna shoot for 10. Actually, let's do, let's do eight repetitions because it's a big combo. Let's do eight. All right, so get in position. Everyone has their knee down. Lift the hip up, extend. Here we go, up, crunch for eight. Woo. Seven, good. Six, keep the abs tight. Five, oh, I'm glad we did eight. <laughs> Four, three, two more. And one more here, good. All right, before we transition to the other side, if you have a towel, remove it. We're doing some donkey jumps up and over for your cardio. So for this move, I'm gonna go ahead and actually slide my tear core up just a little bit so I don't hit my door. Hands form around the top part of that dome, and then we're hopping over, hopping over. Now, if you like to modify this, you can definitely stagger, or you can do like little baby bunny hops up and over. This is gonna be for 30 seconds. All right, ready in five. Four, three, two, let's go. If you're with me here, take your time. If you can pick up the pace, go for it. Just keep your form. You can stagger it. You can do those little baby bunny hops, whatever you want. Woo. You got it. Only 10 seconds left. And also sneaking in some shoulders too. I'm sorry about that. Four, three, two, and stop. Whew. Sneak a drink if you like, but we're gonna go right on the other side. Get your towel again if you have it. <sighs> All right, those two moves. First off, obliques, rotations. Stack the feet or inside knee down. We'll take a quick rest and then the outer thigh knee crunch. Okay, so when you're ready, set yourself up. We have 10 of these. Hand behind, abs in. Let's go, exhale, inhale for 10. Nine, Woo. eight, good, seven, you got it, six, five, four, three, come on, you're almost there, two more. One more, stop. Take about 20 second rest. Shake it out, shake it out. All right, inside knee down, hip is lifted, outer thigh, little oblique crunch, and then we pull it in, eight of these. Get in position, elbow down, inside knee, extend the leg, extend the arm. Here we go, up, down, crunch, eight. Breathe, Woo, seven, 
Smooth controlled. Six. Nice. Five. Four. Three. Two. And last one, good. You know what, I'm so sorry. One more set, 30 seconds of those donkey kicks up and over. You've got it, it's 30 seconds. We're at home stretch for this workout. We're gonna go in five. All right, you know your options. Ready, three, two, let's go. Can you kick those heels even higher up to the glutes? I know you can. <laughs> Stay with it. Breathe. Halfway 15. Even if you're getting a little bit fatigued with this jump, do the staggered if needed. Breathe. Four, three, two. Oh, and stop. Pause the video, grab a drink, and I'll meet you back here. For the last few minutes of this workout, we're gonna finish with some core and a quick stretch at the end. All right, so starting off, take a seat on the edge of your terracor and then lean back all the way. And you wanna make sure that your head all the way down to your hips are supported. You don't feel like you're gonna roll off, but it still feels a little bit unstabilized because we're on that dome. We're gonna hit some crunches. Hands like behind the head, engage the core, look at your ceiling. And then when you're ready, crunch up and lower with me. Here we go, exhale, inhale. We're not pulling on the neck. Shoulders back, elbows back in your peripheral vision. <sighs> Squeeze. Think about pulling that belly button to spine and like you have a small orange between your chin and your clavicle so you're not dipping your chin like that. That's not good. It also cuts off the airway. <sighs> and lower. Four more, let's for my cues. We're gonna add some pulses. Three, in two, stay on top. Arms reach in front, pulse, eight. Seven, shoulder blades lifted. Four, three, now pretend like you're pulling a rope for eight. Seven, little twist, six, five, higher, four, three, right to it, hands behind, back to your crunch. Up and down, exhale, inhale. Good, two more. Let's sneak some obliques in, hold it down, fingertips down, cross that other foot over. If you're good with balance, you don't need to have your fingertips down. I like it for extra security. When you're ready, 10 twists right here, over, 10, nine. So these are very basic movements that you've probably done on the floor, but doing them on the terracore is like five times harder. <laughs> good, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, staying on the same side. Hold it down, kick the leg up. We're gonna add a little inner thigh in and out and do that 10 times. Here we go. 10, nine, good, take your time. Seven, six, five, four more right here. Three, two, one more. Take a quick break. Oh, stretch out the abs. All right, last side, and then you are done. Ready? Fingertips down, other way. Cross that foot over. Let's cross. Take it, 10, and down. Nine. Exhale, eight. Ooh, seven. Good. Four more. Four. Three. Two. All right, take a five second pause just to extend this leg. 10 inner thighs, ready? 10, watch your balance. Nine, this is it. Eight, seven, six, five. Come on, finish strong. Last four, three, two, and final time. Set the foot down, extend those legs, full body stretch. You can stay on top of that dome. Good work. Deep breath, inhale. And exhale out. Good. Hold that stretch, deep breath in. Exhale out. And final time, inhale. Good, exhale out. Go ahead and bring those feet in. One, two, three, rock it up, seated position. Whew. 
Let's go ahead and do a quick little stretch, a straddle stretch. I'm gonna sit on the edge, extend those legs out, and then take the fingertips, walk it over. You can even reach towards your toe. Good. Again, definitely take more time to stretch. This one's gonna be really brief because I'm kind of trying to keep the workout under 20 minutes. I don't know if I succeeded or not. <laughs> Good, go ahead and sit on top. One hand down, one arm up and over, stretching the sides. Inhale, exhale, other way. One more side. And last side here. Good, sit up tall, interlock the fingers behind, open up the chest and heart and give me a deep breath, inhale. Exhale out. Arms in front, round the upper back, dip the chin. Inhale, reach all the way up to your ceiling and let it out. My name is Allison. Thank you so much for working out with me and I look forward to seeing you next time. Great job on completing that workout. If you haven't done it yet, make sure to tap the subscribe button and the bell to stay notified with the latest fitness videos released every Mondays and Thursdays. If you have any workout requests, please leave a comment in this video. My name is Allison. Thank you so much for working out with me and I look forward to seeing you next time.